what I do, and this is what I got for Christmas. So I'll just, you know, gradually, I'll just do it in little clips so I don't waste time um, taking each out of the bag to put on the bed to show you. But the first thing I have, since it's already on the bed because I was taking pictures of it, is this adorable sushi, um, like, basket of, like, container-shaped plushie with little mini sushi plushies on the inside, which, um, I think I'm gonna keep the, uh, like little plastic things on, so they keep attached to the bowl so I don't lose them, but here we got is the tuna, so cute, then the salmon with salmon oil, I guess, look at it, it's so cute. Kind of reminds me of a ditto face, but anyway, I got this one from my brother. Um, so it was like an egg, like the fried egg one, <laughs> like little, I don't know, like carrot, flour, I don't know. Here is, I guess it could be another salmon one, just without the salmon roll on it. Look at it, it looks like a duck face. Uh, don't mind sniffing, sniffing. Okay, here's, I'm not really sure, it could be just be rice. I'm not sure. I look at little, little feet. And some row on top. But also, the other cute thing is, this, like, the fake seaweed that they always put in it. It's still a little happy face. It's so cute. So, yeah. Awesome! So, next one up is... This is my overprotected self-wrap. As you see, I find it amusing when I wrap it like this too. Anyway, I'll open it and show you up close. This is easily slide out. Maybe I should just keep this like this. <laughs> but anyway, this is the WD Elements SB Portable Storage 4 Terabyte hard drive. I, I, I needed more space. You know, for my anime stuff and my, uh, you know, <laughs> YouTube stuff. But as you see, I'll see. There's a. I got this from uh, Curry's and PC World. Not sponsored or anything. But their packaging when I got this, their their you know packaging outside warehouse box or whatever, was absolutely like trash. It was it wasn't good at all. It, it just wasn't good. So, this doesn't want to open. Hold on, I just need a hand. I mean, do. Yeah, anyway, so I'll just pull this out. Uh huh. Hello. Um, it's very compact. Got its own charge thing, cable thing, the bar. Oh, look at that. What? Open easy? I guess. You need to. Well, anyway. It's got a little. Happy bit. Not that you need, need to see me open this, but it's just it's like the uh, that shaped cord. You know, that goes goes in here. And very nice and compact and. 
I technically did not get a case specifically for this because I do have other case that's a bit bigger but I could use it for this instead. You know, basic instructions. Kind of plug it in and whatnot. But anyway, yes, that. Awesome. So that's that. I don't have to just keep it in this right now because I don't have this. But uh, yes, so that is that. So, next. This is from my sister. And I just noticed when I looked at the back that the entire back is in German. <laughs> but, um, it is okay since the uh, thing down there says that. I think it is English, or at least there's English subtitles. Yes, um, English subtitles and is Japanese, I think. Let's see, spread, so spiel text. I like guess language text, so subtitles. And Sprach. Sprachausgabe. Uh, I'm guessing that's the language. Like what it's actually talking. And enter. I can't read that far. Uh, enter. Taisho. It's in English. I'm not sure. But hopefully I can read this. It should be. It should, it should be okay. Oops. Next up is this cool Harry Potter letter writing set. Which includes writing paper envelopes and wax seal stickers. Sweet. And there are... 20 sheets of A5 writing paper, 10 envelopes, and 10 stickers. So, I'm guessing people are thinking, well, 20 sheets, then there's 10, so two, two writing, pa writing papers per envelope? <laughs> anyway, awesome! Uh, she uh, left the price tag on there, for, but uh... I'm very surprised that she found this at the chemist in Cowbridge. I mean, you'd never think you'd find this at the chemist. I'm gonna have to visit there to see what other Harry Potter stuff they have there. I am intrigued. Okay, so. Next up is that she also found this at the chemist. It's a Hermione enamel pin bag. So, uh, my brother gave me this one because he doesn't really watch that. But the one that I opened was Ron. And my sister has a uh, Harry. But she found these at the chemist, which I was surprised. So, yeah, I'm gonna have to go to the chemist and get the rest. Or whatever rest there are for my pin board. Because now I've got two of the trio, that one the other one. So that's awesome. Here is Lord Voldemort's wand with a sticker kit. And it lights up. There it is the snake with the wand. And ta -da! it lights up. Yay! Awesome. Um, if you were wondering, there's a button right here. Which presto. Okay, that's it. Awesome! I forgot to show you the sticker book, didn't I? But uh, it's got a couple, you know, stickers. You know. Yeah, 
Anyway, on to this. The Golden Snitch. I'll show you this first because I'm going to forget if I don't. But it's like, it's got Harry in here. It's got House Crest. It's got Cedric. More house. Well, it has all the House Crest. It's got Draco in here. And the, uh, the main. Now here we have the golden snitch which we're going to put together. <laughs> so that's where the wings go. That way. It's just... Well, anyway, ta -da. just basic little mini figure thing. So I could put that with the rest of my figures or whatever. And that's that, boy. Oh, yeah. But I think it doesn't go like the side, it's just, yeah. Anyway, on to the next thing. I have a super duper thick candy cane. I'm not sure how I'm gonna eat that. <laughs> it's, it's gonna take a while. <laughs> Here is the next thing from our friends and neighbors. And this is so pretty. It's like, I would say it's similar to like the top half part. It's just like a little mini figure in a box. That's just an angel thing. But like this one, it's really pretty. And look at all that sparkle. Though now I've got glitter on the bed. Oh man, glitter is going to be everywhere. I already have a couple on my hands. Anyway, it is so pretty. I'm gonna put this on my figure well, with my other figures. Obviously, it's it's an ornament, but and also on the on the back. Uh, kind of amusing. This product is a decoration only. It is not a toy. Strictly not suitable for children under 36 months. Hmm. Yes. I'm not sure if you'd actually buy it for a kid, under a child, toddler, baby, under 36 months, I don't know, but uh, look at them sparkles, look at the sparkles on the bed, right, it is so pretty. I'm serious. I mean, look at all of this glitter. I mean, it's everywhere. I probably should not have done this on the bed. <laughs> Here's the last word. And they won't go away. Um, I mean, it's... It, it's everywhere. I got a sparkly duvet now. Well, I think it's sparkly uh, floor now. <laughs> they won't go away. Okay, um. Right. This is sort of averted. Anyway, so just just like a random thing. This is what what the thing came in. Because I'm not absolutely you know, weird. Uh, look at it. Look at all those cute penguins. And look, the penguins have glasses. Yeah. 
This is so cute. So, so I'm keeping parts of this anyway. Because I'm strange. Okay, so, moving on. I found another gold glitter. Oh well. And I got some glitter on this. Here is a shirt. I guess it's a night shirt. It feels like a night shirt. Ooh, I don't have to wear this. Well, obviously I'm going to wear it. But it is cute. Glamour post. <laughs> That's what it says. But it's so soft. It's, well, probably because it is, uh... Actually, can I wear it? I normally wear my things in large or medium. Because 10, 12, I'm not really sure. I fit this, actually. I'm pretty sure it was like... I have no idea anymore. But, um, this is 100% polyester. And it is so soft. I'm going to have to try it on later. But I'm not sure if the shoulders are broad enough. Because I do have pretty broad shoulders. So that's that. The next one... Is it's got penguins! It's a penguin! Ooh! It says Winter Wonderland. And it is a chubby penguin. This is small as well. So this is six to eight. Ooh, this is different. Made in Cambodia. And it most likely is also here's the tag on the inside. There it is. It is... Um... 100% polyester again. I'm not sure that you guys need to know that. Okay, next up, we got some trouser buttons. Some very nice striped with hearts and like shiny thread. So that's nice. And by the way, mom did say that she washed this before, so I don't need to have her wash it again. This is pretty nice. It's got flowers. Pretty. Hopefully they fit. <laughs> if you notice, these are all nighttime water stuff. Ooh, okay. So this is the top for that. Oh yeah, by the way, these this this pair is not polyester. Made in Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Yeah. Anyway. This is very nice. And it comes with an extra button. It's... Uh, since I'm telling you anyway, so I might as well... <laughs> Tesco International. Um... I just had to find the English. Uh, viscous? Um, is that even what I'm looking for? I don't know. That's the only thing I can read. But anyway, it, it's not polyester. It's more of a smooth material. Um, next, we have... Ooh, a shirt. It's I Love the Night. Nice. 
So this one is 14 to 16, so I'm pretty sure I can fit in this one. And this is made in China. And this uh, thing, I think it's polyester again. Same as the uh, other ones. Oh, this is from Primark or something. Okay. It's polyester, yep. Good, because I'm getting cold. Oh, yes, and um, I got some chocolates down there in my stocking. I probably should have done the contents of the stocking first. Maybe. And these, obviously, are the trouser bottoms, which go along with the. I love the. Well, um, whatever that said. I forgot. Shirt sure, that I just did. So stars go on with it. And I probably should have done this before the other presents. Is that everything? Yeah, that's everything. Okay, here we have a couple Santas. So four Santas, and we've got a few bears. Did I miss a bear? Yes, I missed a bear. Four Santas, four bears. Along with a lanyard. Very nice, nice. There you go. Sorry, I, I'm putting it in position for the picture. See? Nice. And by the way, the, uh, this, this thing was in the stocking too. Um, now, as what most people think, you should start off with the cards. Well, these were in the stockings. And I'm doing stocking contents last for some odd reason. So here is a lovely Christmas card. And I probably should include the other Christmas cards I got. But they're all the way on the other side of the room. And I can't be able to get out of bed right now. So I don't know if I'll put a picture or not. No idea. Well, it depends if I can remember. But anyway, it's a lovely Christmas card. It reminds me of a Christmas jumper or a sweater or whatever you wish to call it. And, ta-da, 10 pounds. Sweet. That's from Judy, family friend. So I will have to email her thanking me. But I like the 10, because it has Jane Austen on the back. She's my favorite author. Well, I like Pride and Prejudice, so. But the other ones, I don't know if I actually read them, but I watched the movies. But I have read Pride and Prejudice because it was like the first proper book I read when I was like seven. <laughs> and, like it barely had any pictures or anything. But anyway, um, here is this card from Mom and Dad, and there is a twenty. It's um, it's I can't remember if they've actually made the twenty. Like the new 20 yet or not? I don't think so. They were last I looked on the new for like ages ago that they were having a a vote of which what person to put on the 20. I think it was the 20 way. Right? Anyway, it was like um, the mathematician or a scientist or something that they put on it. You know, for their person. Who is that? Oh, Adam Smith. Uh. Whoever that is. <laughs> I'm not good with people. <laughs> I'm not names and stuff. But like, on the, uh... Five? Oh yes. I, I got a five from a friend, a uh, neighbor friend. And let me just get my, um, wallet out here. Where did I put it? <laughs> it is in here somewhere. Come to me. 
Aha. How did I walk it all the way over there? Okay. This is what I mainly keep in at home. I don't take this with me. It's too huge. But um, my dad got this for me for um, in um, I think it was, it was either Thailand or Thailand. I can't remember. But this is the five, and this one has Winston Churchill. And I, I do know who he is at least. <laughs> So this is from a neighbor friend. Friend neighbor. Oh, excuse me, I'm sorry. Oh, well, I have this open. I might as well put the rest of my money in here. So, 25, 35. And if you notice, these are like a lot smoother and smaller. And it's not like proper paper paper, it's, it's a different material. You know? So. so I wonder if anyone would be interested in actually seeing what's actually in my wallet. Not much, because I don't really take this with me, but I have the rest of my card things in there. But, uh, anyway. If I do not put the rest of the Christmas cards in here, then I would have forgotten. But I might have taken a picture or not. I don't know. But I keep the Christmas cards anyway. I stick them in my scrapbook. Like, in a different scrapbook, not my Pokemon scrapbook, because that's only for Pokemon. But, um, yes, I'm going to need to get more scrapbook or puka pads or journals or whatever, because I'm running out of space in my huge A3 Pokemon scrapbook. <laughs> I've actually got a couple pages, like, a few pages left. But anyway. Man, my nose is annoying. That is everything. I will do, um, ooh, do I have space to do a massive picture of everything? That's a thought. <laughs> well, we'll see. If I don't, then, yeah, we'll do loads of series of pictures. <laughs> and, uh, I should take a picture of everything for my thumbnail picture. Well, I'll, I'll decide later. Anyway, thank you for watching. Have a Merry Christmas, everybody. And why don't you leave a comment, like, what did you get for Christmas? Anything special, anything, like, you really thrilled about or whatnot? Let's see. I, I really love this sushi plushy thing in the box. I mean, it's so cute. I mean, look, look at that face. I like the duck face. It's just so cute. That reminds me of Ditto. But... It's just so cute. Ah. Um, yes. So, thank you for as I did actually say this, didn't I? Man, I'm repeating myself already. Um, ring that doorbell for notifications. Over and out.